Hey everyone, Dogmatic71 here, and welcome to Dogmatic DIY. Do you feel you need a home security system but don't have the money to pay for it? Do you have some old mobile phones sitting around your house and you didn't haven't thrown them away yet? Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how to use your old phones as cameras for security cameras for free. Let's get started. Okay, so I'm gonna show you how just to use a cell phone. You can use more than one. Um, this will, I already have one set up on an old Galaxy and here I have an Alcatel phone. I'm gonna set this one up as well. As I bought this phone a couple years ago, when I had no choice, my Nexus, I, said, I think I had a Nexus 6P back then a couple years ago, and it bricked. So I bought this until my contract was up to buy another one, and I just kept it as it's still fairly new. So it just sits here, and now I have another um, Google phone, so I have a Pixel 2 XL. Um, I can use that to view my cameras. So first you're gonna do, it works with both iPhones and Android phones. So you can do it, get it in your the iOS, your that store and Play Store. So we're gonna do, we're gonna to go to Play Store. And then what we're gonna do, you go search for apps and then see how it says here, Alfred, just type in Alfred and then they'll find it. See, Alfred Home Security. Now there is a paid version and a free version, so I'm just going to show you the free version. So you just accept, and then it's going to install. So I'll come back after it's installed. It's 14 megabytes. Now you got to make sure that you're all on the same Wi-Fi network. The cameras are anyways it, it won't matter to uh for your home phone uh, the phone you're viewing like your the, your current phone that you use every day because i can be at work and i can look from work to see what these cameras are seeing i can record i can record audio i record video uh, and i'll save certain recordings and in the settings you can even do motion detection which is really cool concerning your figure it's just a phone camera, right? Uh, but it actually has motion detection, so it will start recording when it detects motion. So, okay, so now we're done. So let's click open. Okay, so we can go, welcome to Alfred. We turn your old phone into home security cameras. Hit skip. See what you care about with motion detection and live. So let's try it out. Now here, as soon as you set it up, you'll see a viewer and a camera. So the phone that you want to view all your cameras from, you would click it as viewer. Like the phone that I'm actually recording the video is on is my viewer. So this one here, I want it to be a camera. So I'm going to hit camera and then hit get started. Now you'll sign in with Google. So I'll sign in. And then I'll come right back. Okay, so already see how easy that is. Now, one more step, hold on. Uh, see, now you even can see it on your computer if you want. You just go into here and dot computer, and you can see that as well. Do not press the home power key as it may shut down the camera Wi Fi. Tap save power to dim and lock the screen. Okay, so now you can see my phone is now on my camera and I'll show you what it looks like on my phone. I'll do a screen capture on my phone and you'll be able to see the rest of this video. Okay, so hopefully you can see this. See on there where it says Alcatel 5054, watch. If I click on that, 
it'll now show me where I'm going, see? Now it shows it. Now I already have a second phone. Book up to it, so let me put this down for a second. And then we'll back out of here. You do have to worry about some ads though, since you're paying for free. But then when you scroll up, you see I have a Galaxy. I have an old Galaxy. This right now, sitting on a charger in my room. So you can click that one and see that one's all set up too. See? And then what you can do is you can see if I'm at work and I want to see if there's any motion, see there it says Alcatel underscore five zero five four zero, and then you go all the way to the right. It looks like a little play sign in a box to the right side there. You click on that and I'll show you things that are here. So like, let's go to the galaxy one and You'll see, see there's events, 7.45 p.m., 7.02 p.m. for events. See, it'll, sh it'll play little things. Okay. See, it shows seven. So what you want to do first, let's go to Alcatel and hit the little gear settings here on the top left. And here you go. You can change the camera name. I'll just leave it as it is. Now you can say motion detection. Let's turn that on. So it'll detect any motion, and once that does that, it'll start making little videos. And then you will you can delete the camera way at the bottom here. You can have a delete camera. You can do the auto light filter. Now it does do, um, I noticed the, the Galaxy one does still film at in the dark. It's not doesn't enhance it like an infrared camera would, but it does detect and emotions in the dark so and that's pretty much it that's all you have to do so let's get out of here and if you clicked on here there you go and now it's moving now I can record that right here in the bottom record or I can have the odd record the audio the see you can audio. allow or deny audio or, deny audio. or you can click on or here click and it'll record see now it says it's recording and you can you'll hear a uh, echo because, uh, I, have echo because I have the other phone here okay so let's back out and get rid of the ad and then see even shows you your battery power on your phone. See, it says underneath that Alcatel, it says what time it is, the date, and it says percentage. Now you'll notice the picture there. Well, that is just still shots it takes. But now watch if I click, okay, let's see. click the little play button here. There you go. See, I, now I have one event. So detect the motion. So you click on it. See, 14 seconds long. There it goes. It detected motion of the phone. So now you just put it somewhere out your window, at your front door or out your back door. Just stick it somewhere where you're near a plug. And now you'll be able to see that. Now, if you want to erase this, you just where the picture where it says one event just put, click and hold it until it highlights and then you can click the trash and delete it now your book's empty because it'll delete in seven days so it's nice and easy this is free now you get to use your old phones and you're good right now your your old phones aren't just sitting there collecting dust or you know doing nothing so and then if you shut it off see i just shut the camera off on that phone it'll say the camera is offline now there's a couple of reasons why it'll be offline either your Wi-Fi is down or the camera battery is dead or you just shut it off yourself on the app now I can be at work I'm not uh, my phone is not my Wi-Fi but I can still view this stuff from work 
because they're under the same account. So make sure your Google account or whatever account you're logging all these in, you log all of them under the same account and you're good. So I hope you enjoyed this. If you got any comments, leave it in the comment section below. Please hit that like and subscribe button. Please hit that bell to be notified when I post another video. And we'll talk to you later.